How dare you? Did I ask you for anything? Did I? But I saw it and felt it would be cool on you. Oh, that Kula. Well done, Mr. Kula. Mr. Feel Good. And you don't feel good about going out there to work and get your own money. No, you don't feel good about that. But you feel good about spending the money that you did not work for, isn't it? What kind of nonsense is this? Between you and your God, if you had worked hard for your money, would you spend that amount buying this dress? Will you? No, no, because it's not your money now, of course, it's not yours. You didn't work for it, you didn't sweat for it. You didn't! So you can spend it anyhow you like. But it's our money. Eh? You say? Our money? Like how? No, 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 tell me, how is it our money? Oh, we set up a committee and walked to the bank together to open an account. No, no, I want to understand. Our money, how? Like how? Seriously, my own hard-earned money, my sweat. He was sitting here referring to it as our money. See, with due respect, they thought that we fire you a big fool. A very big fool, a big idiot, that's what you are. Our money indeed. Like you know how the money got into my account. Or you even have an idea of how much it is I have in my account. Our money. Well, you didn't have to insult me, Bimbo. Did I insult you? Oh, this is an insult. Hey, I understand now. It is, you know the truth is always very, very, very bitter. You don't want to hear the truth. What I said was a statement of facts and not an insult. Oh God, give me my card! Don't waste my time. Let me have my card. Our money indeed. Please give me my card! Henceforth, you are going to seek my consent before you spend a penny. If you really want to spend money, go out there. Get a job like the rest of your mates. Excuse me. Our money. How's it coming along? Baby. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry to get you upset. You know, I was trying to... Don't try to do anything. That's the point. Do not try to do anything. It's fine. Okay. I promise. You know, I hate it whenever you're angry. So why do you always do this? Why do you always do this to me? Why? No, tell me. Are you a child? Baby, it's because I love you. Because you love me? It's the reason you get on my last nerve. Are you serious? Baby, listen. Only men with money are permitted to get on their woman's last nerve. Because they have the same money to calm down her nerves. It's like giving me a headache and you can't afford to buy me Panadol. Does it make sense? Don't do that again. I, I may do something. Something very nice. What did you cook? Is, isn't this what it's supposed to be? I mean, I'm out there hustling and stressing myself, working my ass out for the both of us. This is the least you can do, all right? Not trying to piss me up all the time. What did you cook, Joe? Fried rice and turkey. Your favorite. Sure, you won't serve me again. I'll serve you. Mm. Can I? Thank you. After all, you're not totally useless. The things you do right. Just give me some minutes, I'll get it for you. I'm waiting. Thank you. And I'm so hungry. Hold on, I'm coming. Hey girl. Hi baby. How are you, my love? I'm good. I've missed you. Oh, I've missed you too. You look so pretty. Come to see it. Thank you. Good to see you. My darling. Ha, <laughs> huh, it's as if this holiday was specially crafted for me. In fact, I need it. I know, right? Ah, my dear. I am so busy. My life is about work, 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 and work. There's really nothing else in my life other than that. Yeah. I'm forgetting the cash out. Of course the cash, but man, you don't pray to be in my shoes. I'm just too busy. I know, I know. Aww. 
missed you. I know. I missed you more, my darling. Hi, Kimmy. Hi, Rosa. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. It's been a while you dropped by. Yes, yeah, so work has been so demanding. Oh. I need to make out time to see my baby girl. I see. Uh, yeah. Babes, you didn't offer your friend something to drink? She just got here. Okay, so um, what would you like to drink, please? Really don't want to stress the world. It insists anything that would do. I'll get juice for you. Okay. One minute. Your bobo is nice, shall <laughs> All broke men are sweet. Uh -uh. Stop now, beams. Uh -uh. Tell me something else. <laughs> I mean, what choice does he have? My dear, same old story. You see, my life. My life is not even. There's nothing to envy about my life. It's crazy. Work. Here you go. Okay. Oh, so much. Yeah, welcome. Yay! Oh. I'm sorry. What, what, what is this? I mean, what is this? Why are you doing this? What's the meaning of this? You never get anything right in your life, ever. I mean, what, what, what? It was a mistake. A mistake? Yeah, exactly. He's full of mistakes. All his life, he never does anything right. Mistake and mistake and mistake. You just take a look at her dress. You just ruined it. Babe, that was just a mistake. You know, of course. Of course, he's expected me. That's what I'm saying. Are you a child? You are a grown man. You need to act like an adult. What is all this? Look, 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 just look at her. Look, look at my friend. See her dress. Mistake. Because you're not watching. Are you blind? Okay. What is this? So clumsy. Come, come here. Oh, it's clumsy. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. A grown man acting like a child all the time. Are you, are, you, are you a boy or a man? Tell me about it. What is this? I'm sorry. I mean, I, I, I don't even understand why a grown man keeps acting like a child all the time. Acting like a, like, like a baby. I'm being serious, of course, I'm being serious. He's, he's always doing this. This is not the first time. He's always like this. Always spilling things, bobbing into things and, 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 and just acting, acting like a child all the time. I mean, it's annoying. Why are you being so harsh on me? Babe, I beg. I beg. What kind of embarrassment is this now? No, is this not embarrassing? Is this not embarrassing? Oh my God. Oh, my goodness, it's still raining. Heavy. Oh, I had fun today. Thanks for coming over. <laughs> mm? I really miss you, honestly. I'm I happy know. you made it. You know, it's so cool spending time with you. I know, right? It's a pleasure to have you. For beams. What? I know you don't want to hear this, but I'm going to say it anyway. What is it? After all, it's only a true friend that will look into your place and tell you what is right and what is not. Okay, so what are you driving at? Lusa is a cool guy. I know he might not be all that wealthy yet, but it's... Oh, please, my darling, it's, it's really not about that. It's not okay, let alone be wealthy. <laughs> what are you saying? Yo, do, you, do you see how this guy looks at you? This guy <laughs> worships the ground you step on. This guy loves you. Kemi, listen. Nosa is my man. Okay? Oh. I don't want you to worry your pretty head over my relationship. Just let me handle him the way I deem fit. I give All up. All right? Sorry, ma'am. Good. So sorry. Now, you see this umbrella? I am not dashing you. Okay? I... Keep it for me. In fact, when next I see you, I'm collecting it. That's the receipt again. <laughs> oh my god. Your car for me. Love you. Take care of yourself. Okay. All right, baby. Hey. Ade. Oh my god. Open the gate for my friend. <sighs> careful, careful. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Take care. I love Bye. You. <laughs> my umbrella. Oh. Hey. Doll. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't worry. I was just joking. Oh my god. She has left? Yeah, she has. You know, talking down on me in front of a friend, that, that wasn't necessary. And you acting like a child in front of my friend was necessary, right? Bim, I'm not trying to, you know, argue with you. You know, all I'm saying is, 
if you continue to talk down on me in front of your friends, how do you, how do you expect them to respect me? When you start respecting yourself, okay? It starts with self-respect. You respect yourself first and then others will respect you. What is all this? Respect is earned, my darling. You cannot go about acting like a child, a, a, a schoolboy, and expect people to respect you. No, 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 no. Nobody respects an irresponsible man. <laughs> so, is that why you disrespect me? I, I, see, I don't understand you. What's all this, all this talk and buzz about respect, respect, and respect? What, what, what is this? You think you sit around the house lazy about and then you expect respect to fall from heaven like manners? Who thought you that? You present yourself the way you want people to see you. That's how they carry you. You can't go about, you're acting clumsy and, 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 and doing things like, 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 like a child. And then you're, you're, you're preaching respect and re please don't stress me. If you want respect so badly, go out there. Get yourself a job. Alright? Man up. When you have a job and you start earning your own money, let me tell you, you don't even have to ask for it. People will respect you naturally because people respect responsible men. All right? Ah, please, oh, don't stress me. Today is public holiday. A day meant for people like people who work so hard to rest. Don't spoil it. Don't ruin my holiday. I didn't sit at home here to be, to be lectured about respect and no respect. Sissy, I beg, if you don't want me in this room, just tell me to go. No, 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 no. Come on. Please, relax. Why are you stressing me now? I'm sorry. Why are you stressing me like this? Every time you just like to stress me, like to make me talk. It's just the two of us in this house, but we live as though we are like 10 people because you always, you bring the worst out of me. But I'm, I'm sorry. I've just said that now. Sorry. That's what you always do. To make yourself look like the better one. Small thing now, you're sorry. The next thing, you're the one that will sit and be, uh, and be generating the conversations that will lead, lead, yeah, so lead to yeah, arguments. Rest. Rest. Shake on the pillow. But I don't want this one. It's okay, fine. What's that? What's that? It's okay, fine. Who was that? What kind of black man is that? What's it's okay, fine. Eh, so that you are the you are the better one and the bad one. No. You're not talking to me again. I'm sorry. I'm talking to you. Ooh. Sorry. I, can I let go? Okay, let me just go. Okay. Let it just end. No, let me just go. Okay. I'm smiling now. Why not smiling? Why, not here? Why are you acting so humble? I'm not humble. I'm rude. Sorry. <laughs> what do you mean? You're not humble. You're rude. You're rude. I mean, oh, so you're rude. Drop your hand, Ben. So you don't want to bring me close to yourself? Okay. Come close to myself. You keep me at arm's length, but you say it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Come close to my length. So. Don't press me down, you. Ah, you want to compress my head? Guy. Hello? Hey, now? I'm just about to leave for work. What's up? What's... Can I rush and come see you, please? I'm almost late. Uh, I'll be with you in 10 minutes, please. 10 minutes? Yes, 10 minutes. Babe, are you sure you'll be here in 10 minutes? 10 minutes. Latest. Okay. I'm waiting. <sighs> Kemi, Kemi, this is really bad. I know, right? You know, right? You carry your money, give man. Hey! Kemi, you gave him all your money. He needed it for business. Okay. Oh. And in this age and time, at your old age, you are behaving like a secondary school girl in love. You carried all your funds and gave to a man. Kemi, I'm ashamed of you. I mean, why did you allow yourself to be this gullible? This is stupid. This is not love. This is stupidity. You are servicing him at the same time, funding him. 
Okay, calm down now. No, 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 make it make sense. You gave your body and your money at the same time. <laughs> Babe, you know, try. Wait, haven't you heard of the saying that you cannot put your money where your body is? You carry your money, give man. Eh? I understand. Um, no, no, see your life for Potopoto now. See, see, see where it has landed you. Love has landed you where? No, where? Tell me about it. You were in love with him. Because I've never been in love before. And you are the first person to be in love. Is that right? I'm in your house. Hey, Kimmy. Good morning. Hi, Nosel. Are you traveling? Um, Kemi will be living with us for some time. Okay. Is everything all right? <laughs> ah. Of course, everything is not all right, but there's nothing you can do about it. Because the worst you can do is to sympathize, and this is not a case for sympathy. It's not as if you can contribute anything to whatever is wrong. I beg. I beg, I beg, I beg, no, no, stress me. Don't no, stress me. I am off to the gym. Here, calm down. I beg, I beg, I beg, let's talk about you. Forget about me. You are the focus here. But seriously, I don't know if you mumu like this, oh. In this age and time, you carry money, give man. I was only being a supportive girlfriend. A supportive girlfriend. You go trust Adam. <laughs> hey! Huh? You are so foolish. And to think I never knew you were this foolish. And you're my friend. That's what you, Mumu. Hey! Can you at least show me to you? My friend, you know the road to your room. No piss me off. I mean, no, no piss me off. Oh. Ha. I'm off to work, I beg. Don't get this time. Hey, you're back. Ah, <sighs> yes, I'm back. Ah, uh, okay. Let me fix your breakfast then. No, don't worry. Don't worry. What about therapy? to talk to you and I realized you were in the bathroom so I decided to wait. Okay, so what is it that you wanted to talk to me about? Gosh. You know, clothes can be so deceitful because you look hot. What do you mean? Without them on. Okay. No, sir. I just came to apologize to you for the way my friend has been treating you. You know, Bimbo has had a lot of men in her life that she no longer recognizes a good man when she sees one. I'm listening to you. Why? I, on the other part, I have loved you from the very first time I set my eyes on you. Shift. Shift. You know I saw you first, right? But she ran to introduce herself. <laughs> Such. I totally understand where all these are going to. So you need to stop. Come on, Nusa. You're a good man. And good men should be treated with love and respect. What is wrong with you? Don't you find me attractive? Are you shameless? You have the guts to walk into my room to seduce your best friend's man? Oh, please, come off that. You call yourself her man. Hold on. You really still call yourself her man? 
What woman in her right senses would treat her man the way she treats you? She yells at you as like a child, I mean, at every slightest provocation. Are you still... Come on, Lisa. I'm sure you know better, right? Hmm? I'll treat you much better. Just say yes. And all of this... will be yours on a platter. Just say yes. You're an idiot. And if you don't leave here right now, I'm gonna smash your foolish head on the wall. Get out! Look who is back! Hi. <laughs> Welcome, baby. Hey girl, how how was you? work? Oh. Oh, yeah, same as every other day. Very oh. stressful. Yeah, you look it. But today, I added a sprinkle of stress, tiredness, all wrapped together like a meat pie. <laughs> God, I'm tired. Okay. Um, did you cook anything? Of course, I did. I made a goosey soup. <laughs> nice. Because I'm so hungry. I hope there's plenty of stockfish. Uh -uh, or more. Trust me. Intestine. Nami everything. Cook, my girl. Nami I love obstacles <laughs> in my soup. Let me cook. I trust Don't worry. you. You know, um, go freshen up. Let me make you a bar. Thank you so much. Meanwhile, where is Nosa? I'm right behind you, baby. You're welcome. Thank you. That was work. What was I supposed to do about it? Was I supposed to do anything? Well, I am only asking because that chick is cute. I mean, she's beautiful. Look at the whole curves and everything. <laughs> Bimbo, it's fine now. And I cannot cheat on her with anybody. Not possible. No. Guy, would she do the same for you? Yes. She loves me. I love her. We love each other. And I know that she will never disrespect our relationship. No, she won't do that. No. But would you rather disrespect you? Guy, I mean, how do you even cope? I don't get it. Guy, I cannot afford in any way to have a girl talk to me the way she does to you. Like, it's crazy. Thank God. So you're not the one she talks to. Guy, are you for real? Guy, how do you, how do you, I mean, why do you like her talking to you the way she does? You can actually afford to buy yeah. this girl. That's absolutely my business. Okay, fine. What about the appointment with Ray? Can we please talk about something else? Come on. Okay, fine. I heard that Ben got another house. Okay. I know. He told me. As a matter of fact, the day he had his first meeting with the, with the agent and stuff, I was there. Oh, really? The house was cute. So you didn't tell me. So What is it? Where? Huh? What are you doing? 
trying to play with my woman. Please stop, 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 stop. Stop now. Please. Bimbo. You've not been in this mood for the past one month now. Come on. Is it your mm -mm now? Stop. What is this? Is it your mood? Or are you the one that will tell me when to be in and out of mood? I'm telling you my mood. You're telling me you please don't piss me off. Oh, is it by force? Come in nonsense, please, so I can. I'm sleeping you are coming to disturb me for, for what nonsense. God, I beg you, can't sleep. Let me sleep. She won't let you touch her, right? Have you been eavesdropping on us? <laughs> Come on, Nasa. I don't have to. I'm her best friend. She tells me everything. No, sir. You see, everything you... Everything you're begging for in there is right here in front of you. All you have to do is tell me how, where do you want me to end? Shut up. What is wrong with you? Do you do you have no shame? Someone who is accommodating you, you want to sleep with her man? <laughs> oh goodness. Please call off that. Hello. You still call yourself her man? The earlier you realize you're not her man. The earlier you come to terms with that fact, the better for you. You have been. Look at me. Take your sinful self out of my sight. Now you listen to me. This will be the last time I am going to warn you. The next time you try this rubbish with me, I tell you again, the next time you try this rubbish with me again, I promise you, you'll find yourself on the street where you belong. Yeah. <laughs> Try it next time. Bimbo. Yeah. What's happening? Where? Here. Us. We have been living like strangers. Okay? We no longer talk to each other. You only talk to me when it's important to you and 
probably when you want to scold me. And where is all of this coming from? About last night? The day before last night. The day after and after the day. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I get it. So all this is because I... I didn't let you touch me. Bimbo, oh. I ask you. Why do you deny me access to your body? Are you not my woman? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> also, because I'm your woman, I should die. No, I should kill myself because I'm your woman, isn't it? How insensitive can you be? No, 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 just listen to yourself. Listen to what you've just said. Are you proud of yourself? Aren't you ashamed at your level of self-centeredness and selfishness? I go out there every day, walk my ass out morning till night, trying to make money for the both of us. Money to take care of you as my man. And then I come back home after a long, stressful day. All I would need in my life at that point is to rest. But no, because I'm a woman, I should submit myself, make myself available to you to feast on. Right? <laughs> really? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? Being a woman doesn't mean I should, I, I, I should die. I should die. When I'm supposed to be resting, I should make myself available to you to eat. Look, Oga. At, how, look at how comfortable you are talking to me. <laughs> Why, why do you always make me feel like I'm a lazy person? Ain't you a lazy person? Bimbo, I am not. Oh, you're not. Tell I am me about not. It. I go out there every day in search of a job. Okay. Is it my fault that I'm unfortunate to get anyone yet? Oh, of course. It is my fault that you are unfortunate to get a job, isn't it? No, it is my fault now. It isn't yours. It's my fault because I made that happen. Listen, I'm a very busy person by nature, okay? I do not have time for frivolities. I can't sit here and waste my time discussing with jobless people. I have a job to catch. Please, I'm getting late for work. Don't worry, guy. All right, just get me the best. All I want is just the best for her. Okay. All right. Thank. You. I'll call you back. Thank you. Hi. Hi, Kimmy. Sir, top. Can I talk to you? Okay. What is it about? You know, I um. What's going on here? <clears throat> to every man they say there's a perfect woman. Hmm? Bimbo. The last six months of my life with you has been the best of my time. Yes, we had our ups and downs, but trust me, I'd rather have this time with you than to spend it with another woman. <laughs> but Bimbo, do you mean? Yes. Will you do me the honor of spending forever with me? Yes. <laughs> Jokes on you. I am the man of this house. Excuse me. You want to come and propose marriage? Why won't you propose marriage? Because you think you're smart. <laughs> Marrying me is your, is, your, is your way of getting a job and getting your life together. <laughs> As you're thinking of boxing me, me too, I'm thinking way ahead of you. Ten steps ahead of you. Nobody's a fool. That I spend the money does not mean I'm, I'm an idiot. No sense. Um, dude, just get a hold on yourself, okay? Be fine. Why? 
Why? Why? Why? Why, why did you embarrass me like why that? Why what? Why did I embarrass you? What? Did you seek my permission before doing that? Do I need to seek for your permission before asking you to marry me? Oh, really? What have you been doing with me if you are not sure of me? <laughs> Let me ask you a very simple question. If you were a woman, are you going to marry a man like yourself? Hmm? Will you marry a man like yourself? I mean, a jobless one at that. A man who has nothing to do. Zero source of income. Are you going to marry yourself if you wear my shoes? Oh, I know what the answer is already. I work my ass out for the both of us. I practically take care of your needs. From your boxers to your singlet. I pay the bills in this house. And then you think your only way of compensating me is to come propose marriage to me. You must think I'm, I'm daft. I'm not. What, 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 kind of, what kind of nonsense? If my source of income dries up tomorrow, for instance, God forbid though, what happens? What Bimbo, is my backup plan? Bimbo, I am trying. <sighs> I'm trying, but things are not just working out for me. Oh. <laughs> You're trying. What does that tell you? When you try a particular thing in an order and it doesn't work, you simply change your pattern. But no, you're not doing it. You keep doing the same thing all over, all over and over again. All year long, you're seeking for a white collar job that is not forthcoming. And then your sense has not told you that you need to do something else. Think out of the box. Go out of your ways. Do something different. Get a trade. Something. Hand work. It mustn't be a white collar job. It's not meant for everybody. Okay? So instead of you to stay here and start preaching the pity story to me to make me feel sorry for you, go out there like your mates, okay? And look for a source of income. I am the man in this house. I practically take care of our bills. From nepo bills, the house rent. Talking about the house rent, the agent to the landlord just sent me a reminder that this rent is almost due. They sent it to me, not you. Yeah, because I am in charge. You have refused to take charge. Supposing I don't have the money to pay for our rent, will you be able to at least contribute 40 percent? Oh, sorry, 40 percent is too much because you don't have it. 20 percent, for instance. Can you contribute 20 percent of the rent to support me? Can you? No, you can't. And all you're thinking of is marriage. You're thinking of proposing marriage to me to put me in a box. Listen, come back to me with that engagement ring when you are man enough. Okay? When you are now ready to take responsibility because I cannot accept marriage from a man who takes zero responsibility. I cannot. As long as we are in this together and nothing has changed about your status, I am the man of this house. <laughs> I'm the man of this family. <laughs> Why did you do that to him? Pimbo, what is his crime, for Christ's sake? Him not being rich? <laughs> you and I know that all the things that makes a man worthy of love and respect other than money. You know that, right? You name it. Loyalty and security. Beams, that guy has proven to you beyond every reasonable doubt that he's the right man. He's a loyal man. Can't you see? But why would you want me to do that to him? Curiosity. Yeah, I mean, I just, I just want to really know if, if he cheats. He's a man, so. So you're saying he wants me to seduce your boyfriend? I mean, do I need to repeat it over and over? Yes, you heard me. Or you, do, you can't do it for me. That... Okay, you know, um... Uh -huh. Like you said, he's human. Mm -hmm. And he's a man. Mm -hmm. What if he falls for it? 
do it. And oh no, don't do it. Don't don't do it. Or do it better still. Like I don't I don't care, man. I really don't care. All right, my focus is just to establish the fact that he's a cheat or not a cheat. I mean, it doesn't really matter what Pimbo. you do. Pimbo, this is too much. I just need proof. Girl, it's not too much. It is so much. If you don't like this guy, I mean, you can just break up with him, right? Let him go. Are you doing it for me or not? No, answer me now. Are you going to do it for me or not? What's the big deal, girl? You have nothing to lose. Really? I am done with this game. If I were you, I would cherish what I have. This man is this man is loyal to a fault. What is your problem? What else do you want from him? That guy literally sees me as a bro. Like mean, a bro. Why wouldn't he? It's only a foolish man that will fall for you. Excuse you. <sighs> Sorry, that's not what I mean. Don't get me wrong. Everybody, I mean, you're very attractive. Of course. What I'm trying to say is, he knows you're my friend. You live in this house. I practically feed him. <laughs> so he's a smart ass. He's not going to fall for you because, I mean, ordinarily you should think it's a trap. Do you understand what I'm saying? So, I wasn't expecting him to fall for you anyways. Okay. So, what are you insinuating? See, what I think we should do is to set him up with someone neutral. Yeah. Bimbo. Yeah, like somebody with no affiliation to us. Maybe one or two girls, you know. It's okay, you never learn. Okay, let's say I agree to this. Mm -hmm. What if he doesn't fall? I mean, perfect. I have nothing to lose. If he doesn't fall, it simply means he's loyal. Isn't that the test we're trying to put him through? I mean, the, the whole essence is to be sure that he's faithful or he's going to be faithful to me. So if he doesn't fall for you, good a thing. That means I will start considering his, his, his proposal. Pimble, this is not right. But come to think of it, why can't you help him get a job? As what? As his girlfriend. Oh, really? Who is in a better position to do that? Oh, 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 I see. So as his girlfriend, it is my primary responsibility to get my man a job, isn't it? Just hear yourself. You sound very ridiculous. I mean, I was able to get a job for myself as a girl and then a full grown man <laughs> is waiting for me to get him a job when I'm not his mom. See, listen, don't even make the mistake of trying to get a job for a man. <laughs> because if you do, it will backfire. You see, men, they're very terrible. You want me to go about looking for a job for him and then the next thing he will start saying is, oh, I need you to slept with the manager to get me a job. I need you to slept with the CEO to get me a job. See, listen, I am not going to let that happen to me. Where is my friend? Right here. I, huh. no, I, I can't recognize this My sister, here. just wake up and be smart. Where did they keep my... Can me please? Bimbo. What is it? Are you been boring me? Can <laughs> you be this? Oh my god, what finally. My dear. Oh. Oh. If tired, tiredness was a person, that would be me. I just need a very chilled water. Uh -uh. Can you imagine this guy? Maybe he stepped out. He stepped out just this minute I left the house. Ah, yes, calm down now. Oh, wow. You don't even know where he went to. Of course, where would he have? Where, where, where would he go? To see a side chick or a girlfriend or something. 
Oh my god, please calm down. Ah, you're exaggerating this. Are you sure he left? Of course he left. He left. There's no single pin of his left in this house. Everything is gone. Not even a pin. All his belongings are out. Uh, are you panicking? Why are you panicking? I mean, this is what you've always wanted, right? Him out of your life. He just made it easier for us. No. Who said that? I mean, when did I tell you I wanted him out of my life? How did I say that to you? I, I don't want him out of my life. Of course, I, I I was only trying to be sure that he's legit and loyal. That's it. How can you, how can you say I, I want him out of my life? So you love him then? Well, I... I think so. You think... You, you, you still think so, sorry. You're still thinking. Look. I love him. I accept. Finally. Um. Listen. I love him. I, I truly love him. I was only scared. I was scared of my past repeating itself. I didn't want a repeat of that. You know my story. You've been in my life. You know all I've been through in the hands of men. I just wanted to make sure that this was going to be different, okay? But I didn't want him out of my life. I, I love him. I want you. I thought you this guy was loyal and genuine. You, you would have given him a chance. I know you did. You told me. I was just, I was being insecure. It's fine. You know, um, yeah. Okay, Corey. You have his number, right? Oh, Ray, of yeah. course, I do. Oh, okay. Call him. We call Ray. That's true. Oh. Hello? Hello, Ray. Um. Um. Please, is, is, is Nosa with you? No, what is the problem? Um. Okay, please, can you, can you come over to the house? Nosa is nowhere to be found. So what is it that happened? Um, we went out, came back and Nosa was nowhere to be found. Did you check around to see if he left some of his belongings behind or took everything? Yes, he did. Everything, like everything, not even a pin left. Thank God. For what? Because he has finally seen the light. What is he talking about? Light. Yes. The light in what? Anyway, outside this toxic environment is a light, my friend. Excuse me? Of course, you are well excused. But I'm sure you heard me loud and clear. Guys. So you actually thought my friend couldn't do without you? That his entire life and existence solely depended on your insult and embarrassment? Oh no. Guys. <sighs> you are in my house. So mind the way you talk to me. You can't talk to me like that. This is more reason I should actually insult you as I mean as I so wish. Ray, Hello? calm down. Don't you dare tell me to calm down. Now you listen to me. If you are this scared to talk to this sports little brat on how inhuman she's treated my friend, 
Well, I am not. Because you know why? I owe you absolutely nothing. <laughs> this is my house. Okay, you cannot come into my space and disrespect me. You cannot insult me in my own house. So mind the way you talk. This is the last time I'm going to warn you. Mind the way you talk to me. Listen to me. You talk about insult when all you did was just bathe my friend with insult. Oh, you disgust me. You should be ashamed of yourself. Bimbo, whatever you call yourself. Now listen to me. I have a promise for you. Now I'm gonna go out there, I'll find my friend, and make sure nothing brings him to this hellhole you call a house. Yes, everything you did was just to make my friend feel totally depressed. It made him feel so worthless for being in that condition. Oh my goodness. Thank God he found his way of escape. Because I know what? I'm sure the next thing on his mind was probably to go and commit suicide. That's enough. Can you calm down, please? The both of you. We have a pressing issue at hand, and that is finding Nusa. If for nothing else, for his safety at least. Please, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't want this. But he, he's insulting me. Oh, well, Kimi. I can assure you that my friend is found wherever he is. But as for this devil's replica, I promise never to edify him wherever he is. Wait a minute. Abeg, shut up. Wait till they walk you. If I open my mouth to insult you, eh, I said to God you go commit suicide. Wait till they walk you. I don't want you. If they form say your parts know the market. Oh, yeah, go find your boyfriend now. Excuse you. Nonsense.
the way I, I am very sorry. I'm truly sorry for everything that I did. I am ashamed of myself. I, I know I have been a very selfish girlfriend to your friend. But please find it in your heart to forgive me. I, I messed up. But believe me, I love Nusa. I love him. Deep down, I do. All that happened, happened because I was insecure. I have been through a lot in my past. I... I'm sorry. I don't have an excuse. I'm sorry. Please help me. Help me find him. Give me this chance to make things right. I promise I'm going to turn a new leaf. Just tell me where I can find him. Please. Oh well, Bimbo. I'll say this and I'll say it once. I just pray you find him. And when you finally do, that he forgives you. Else, you spend the rest of your life in regret. Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, I think she's really sorry, you know. She called me severally and was apologizing. Even a while ago that I was with her, she was practically crying. And looking at her bro I am convinced she is remorseful about the whole thing. I know you're really hurt, bro, but just let it go. I'm telling you this as a friend. You know I got your back. Trust me, she has seen the consequences of her actions. And from henceforth, she will sit up. It's a promise. Because you know I also spoke to her vehemently. So I'm sure she won't try any mess again. I believe. Bimbo, what is wrong with you? What are you doing to yourself? Are you not going to work today again? Bims, do you want to lose your job because you lost a man? Okay, me of all people know how disrespectful and rude you were to him. But then again, him running off on you like that was equally disrespectful. You have done virtually everything to get in contact with him and everything has proven abortive. Listen, lying around and sulking and self-pity won't change anything. Now get up, you need to get ready for work. Mm -hmm. Please. I just want to be left alone, please. Okay, can you at least stand up and I said, it's... leave me alone. Don't you get it? <sighs> okay, uh, I'll be outside in case you need anything. Hold on. Who is there? Come, good morning. You came back. Very sure.
I said you should leave me alone. Just go, okay? Where have you been? No, sir. No, sir, I am sorry. I'm sorry for everything that I did to you. I am not, I am not proud of what I did. I know I cannot take back the ends of time, but I beg for your forgiveness. Please find it in your heart to forgive me, okay? Look, I have been cheated upon by the men in my past. That has made me build a world of defense around myself. I have trust issues, insecurities. It is not about you. You're perfect. The problem is me. I find it so difficult to trust a man. I have never known a perfect man until I met you. You were so good to be true, like unbelievably perfect that I thought you were pretending. But listen, I promise you, I am going to make amends. Give me another chance to be a better lover, a good girlfriend to you. I promise not to abuse it. I promise. Just give me the chance to love you. Please. Will you marry me? I still have the ring. already yeah what time is it it's past nine o'clock what yeah <laughs> past nine i can't believe i slept for this long yes you did you had a long night of course i had a long night thanks for dealing with me i was gentle Mm. <laughs> I'm not only gentle, so that's your definition of being gentle. So I want to go make breakfast for you. Mm -hmm. Breakfast in bed. <laughs> that's so lovely. So, how long are you going to continue to give me breakfast in bed? For as long as we both shall leave. Hmm. Babe, that's a huge commitment. I'll keep to it. <laughs> baby, I love you. Come on, baby. You know I love you too. Mm. Okay. Thank you so much. So why don't you relax? Why are I going to make breakfast for you? I'm not going anywhere. Good. I am going to spend my entire day today indoors with my man. Oh, perfect. <laughs> perfect. So, give me a few minutes. Okay. I'll be back. I'll be waiting. Great. <laughs> Ah, 
Ah, my babes they sleep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My workaholic, they sleep by this time. Baby, don't call her Oto Oto. Just me now. No, no. Is all this. Oh, well, see, babe. I've been missing out on so much. You know, thinking back, I just they ask myself, say, why have I been the mumu before? Yes. <laughs> God, I mean, where's my friend? Where's my friend? Mm. Mm. Had breakfast too. Of course, so. He served me breakfast in bed. <sighs> Easy. It's all plates. So it's too much, Godwin. <laughs> we go love him. Listen, even if you love, you know, go feel be like my uh -huh. This is serious. Mm -hmm. So Nosa is now. You know, go feel like my Nosa. My Nosa. Okay. They personalize the name. Now you're Nosa. Oh, now you know, Sana, you get her. I bet she. Don't be me. <laughs> oh, verse. Oh, mm -hmm. no, be my Nosa. See ya. My guy, I, I never ever want to make the mistakes of the past again. Aww. I was foolish. I don't just get sense. I just, I just, I just move myself back. Talking about mistakes, mm -hmm. you remember that thing we talked about before his disappearance and appearance? Which? Come on, girl. Set him up with a strange woman. <laughs> God beg you. I know do again. <gasps> what are you saying? I am no longer interested. There's no sense in doing that. I mean, what reason do I have to set up my man to make him go through a test and prove what to who? What point am I trying to prove? What am I trying to achieve? Listen, listen. I am fine with my man the way he is. He's loyal and honest. And that's all that matters. Okay, I give up. Oh, you know, it's not like I'm enforcing it on you. But uh, you know what you went through with Ben and Pope and eh, eh, I didn't want eh, it to repeat eh, eh, itself. Eh, eh, no try and this is what they do not try. I know what you're trying to do. Stop it now, girl. Which can't tell me that you won't compare you, they compare human being an animal. It makes sense. Don't you put no sign the class of those useless, good for nothing idiots. I, I mean they are not there's no basis for comparison. I beg, I beg. If you won't compare, you compare human being to a human being. No sign you See, don't try it. My nose is not like that and can never, never be like that. Which can't talk be that. Wait, 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 wait. hold on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is this what I think it is? <laughs> I'm shy. <laughs> well, hold on. Babe. Of course now, listen, honey, it happened. I wanted to come out and flaunt it, but you just rushed into my bedroom. It ah. happened though. Hey, good. No, sir. No, see what you're doing for that, so. <laughs> no, sir, proposed. Or let me say, re proposed. <laughs> After you touched on the last but one. But this time, I, I accepted. So. Ah, oh, God, this is That's so. It. This is, this is, this is, this is beautiful, girl. Oh, my God, oh my God I'm so happy for you. Come here. <laughs> oh, God, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. Thank you so much. This is beautiful. I know, I know, right? Um, <clears throat> so, um, yeah, like, sorry, excuse me. Like, uh, yeah, can you can you pass me the like, class? Sorry, what, can you, can sorry, you, can excuse you, me. What did you say? Can you? Can you? you, you, you oh, God, keep your <laughs> heart. You don't say Oh, God. Jesus, this is so... <sighs> I've never let this pass me by. Never. So, so, babe. Yes, darling. And um, an old school friend of mine, you know, we met yesterday. Okay. So he called earlier today that um, I drove by his office. Oh, okay. So in that case, you're going out. Yes, I'll be going out because I told him about my situation. So he asked that I come so that let's see what he can do for me. Okay, so in that case, I would just Uber to work. You drive. No, I mean, no. because I would take the car and just pack it in the office. Come on, no, no. I, I can't allow my woman to jump into Uber. Please use the car. Are you sure, baby? Sure, sure. You sure you're going to be fine? 
I will be fine. All right then. Yeah. You can insist. I insist. Uh -huh. Please come back early today. Of course, I will come back early. Don't worry. 5 p.m. and I'll give you a surprise. Really? Yeah. 5 p.m.? Yes. Okay. I look forward to the surprise. You know I love surprises. I do. So, okay. so come back early. All right, my love. Yeah. Take care. Mm -hmm. I, miss you, I miss you more. All right, see you soon and All right. have a nice day. You too, my darling. Have I a good day. Wish you the best of luck. Yep, bye. Bye. Um. I see you both are back together. Yeah, um, we are. I'm happy for you. Yeah, you should. You know, I... I had everything you did during the crisis. Oh. Uh, it's nothing. Thank you. You're welcome. I just hope she doesn't go back to her old ways. You know? Yeah, I, I hope so too. All right, excuse me, I have something very important I'm doing inside. Run along. Thank you. Maria, I need to see you now. You heard what I said, right? Wait, make I understand this thing. Make I try to understand this thing. Right? I don't understand. What do you not understand? The only thing I needed to do is sleep with my friend's fiance. That's all. That's all? Okay, that's not all. I need proofs, video proofs, picture, anything that that implicates you both in the act. <laughs> wait, hey, wait, though. You know, say you know they possible say I will send you video. I mean, sex video while they inside. Ah, they, they calm down. Oh, ah, they, you're, you're smarter than this thing now. Now why are you not supposed to put face? You get. You go any highway you want it. Okay, you know what? Let's forget about the video. You can do pictures, right? Back here, back him, anyhow. Just get me a picture. I need proof. Anything we go make sure, say, on our two day inside the ads. That's what I need. Mm. I don't care how you do it. Okay. Yes, that's all. I trust you. Don't worry. I'll pay you right now. Smart girl. You carry money, my We have a deal then. Yes, so. This local girl. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yeah. Why are you back early? Oh, uh, everything is where's okay. Nosa? He should be in your room. Oh, okay. Um, Bims, sorry. Huh? I, I was hoping to talk to you about something. Um, I, I'll be right back. Let, um, let me finish. I, I'll come back. Okay, oh, wait. Is that a woman you want me to sleep with her husband? Yes. Uh, no, sir, you can't walk out that way. Sorry. You know, the last time I checked, it was 17 million. Call you back, sir. Baby. Hey, babe. 17 million. What are you doing at home? Baby, what's happening? I got an alert of 500,000 from you. Oh, that's part of the rent. 
Sorry I couldn't raise more than that, but don't worry. Wait, 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 wait. Slow down. You sent 500k, half a million naira. Yes. Why on earth did you get such an amount? Come on. Remember I told you a friend of mine, an old classmate of mine, asked me to come to his office today. Okay. So he was the one who gave it to me. Baby. Hmm? An old classmate yes. who just give you 500,000 naira just like that. Uh, well, it's not just like that, okay. you know. But he... <clears throat> He said there's no vacancy in his office, so that I should, um... He gave me the 500,000 to just you know, hold on to myself till December, when he will have vacancy in his office. Ah! Uh, baby, I, I, I'm sorry, don't get me wrong. It's not like I'm not happy for you, I am. But, this story of yours sounds too good to be real. Okay. You walked into someone's office okay. seeking for a job. Good. The job is not available till December, but then he gave you 500,000 500, Like he dashed you. Exactly. Oh, please, baby, tell me something. <laughs> this, is not, this is not true. It's true. Baby, please, I hope you're not doing anything illegal. Do I look like someone who will no, be I into... No, I mean, like, they don't write it on the forehead. You don't need to look like, you know. <laughs> but please, don't get me wrong. Okay. Right? I'm just trying to be sure because yesterday you were worth nothing. And mm. then today, you're giving me 500k. Don't worry. See, let me tell you something very soon, okay? We will be sharing the responsibilities of this home. I will not only pay the rent, I will also take care of the daily activities of a home. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, from what you just told me now, okay. you sounded like he was going to give you a job in December, like there's hope. For very you. big hope. You're getting a job in December. December, I'll get a job. Hey! <laughs> Man of the year! Baby! <laughs> ah, honestly, I'm happy for you. Thank you. Ah, God bless that classmate of yours. Amen. He's such a kind person. I mean, like, who does that? Who does that? Ah. <laughs> oh, baby, you see what I'm talking about? No, look, look, just look at it. Listen, honey. I like this development. It makes me really, really happy. See, Ignore those days I tell you those things I try to disrespect you and all of that. It's it's not really, you know, that wasn't the intention, okay? okay? My intention is to be able to push you beyond expected limits as my man. You see, you see what is you see now, you see what is going on. Can't you feel it yourself? I'm, I feel I'm, it, I'm I so feel happy, it, I feel you know? it. Thank you. Thank I you. I hope that your friend, man. So babes, this is Maria, an old friend. We served together in Kaduna and she was retained and she's been there ever since. <laughs> so this morning she called me that she's in town and she's going to be here for four days, right? Yeah. And she went to spend the four days in a hotel. I'm like, why? Why would you spend money in a hotel when, okay, not like I own here though, but you know, I have a big space here and I'm just all by myself, especially when you're at work. So I told her to just come over and, you know, put up with us and save that money as well. I promise she's not going to bother anybody. Um, it's, it's fine. It's, I mean, it's not a problem. A friend of Kemi is also my friend. Okay, so you're welcome to stay. Oh my God, thank you Maria. so much, baby. Yes. Okay. Oh, thank so, you very much. That's fine, I have to rush back to you. Oh, okay. that's fine, it's okay. I'll see you guys when I come back. Uh, All right, take care of yourself. Thank you. Just be okay. thank you. Um, I'll see you. All right. Bye, baby. Bye. <laughs> Maria, and I'm a friend to Kemi. Okay, I see. Um, I see you've met my friend Maria. Maria, this is Nosa Bimbo's fiance. Oh, I see. Um, I met your fiance earlier on. She's such a nice person. Nice to meet you. Um, Maria will be staying with us for some days before she goes back to Kaduna. <sighs> I see. Maria, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Just, um, free free. I'll see you around, okay? Okay. Ah, babe, this guy is so cute. Oh my God. He's so fine. 
Hello? Are you there? <laughs> Listen, Maria. How good do you want yourself? You have just one job here. Get it done. Get your money. And... Do you understand? Okay. I'll... I won't go... I won't go outside. I'll go do small shy. You won't join me. Mm -hmm. Do you go? You will like them. Mm. <laughs> Babe. Yes, darling. Hope work today wasn't stressful. Hmm. Work is always stressful. Mm. Is there ever a day I'm not stressed? <laughs> In fact, my middle name is stress. I'm already used to it. I need a thorough massage, honestly. All right, you get it. Thank you. Um, Are you okay? Yes. Yeah. The girl came and brought in. Oh, Maria? Yeah. Is she also your friend? No, not really. But, of course, she's a friend of Kebby, so. I see. You know, <clears throat> I'm thinking, you know, it's, it's not safe to allow her in here, you know, just because Kemi said so. Plus, you didn't run it through me. Baby, I'm really sorry, okay? Sorry I didn't run it through you, all right? But I didn't think you'd have any problem with her staying over mm. since she's a friend to Kemi. That's, that's why I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't bother asking you. It was a decision I took for the both of us, really. But then again, I couldn't have said no because... Kemi just presented it to me at the spur of the moment, like right in my face. The girl was seated next to her when she asked me. <laughs> so ordinarily, even if I wanted to say no, I couldn't have. Because that was the same girl looking at me right in my face like this. And Kemi was expecting me to give an instant reply. In fact, from the way she sounded, it was as though she had already given her word to the girl. So, I mean, it was just so much in a rush and I couldn't come back in to ask you. It's okay. It's okay. But I'm, I'm sorry. Babe, Julie. come on. It's okay. You know, I, I don't have any problem with Kemi bringing her in, but please, we have to be careful. <sighs> Honestly, I understand. Okay. But I don't think we have anything to worry because according to Kemi, she'll be out in four days. Okay. So it's meant to be a very short stay. So hopefully. Hopefully. Mm -hmm, she leaves in four days. That's fine. So do you want me to massage your thigh? <laughs> Baby, is that even a question? I said I am tired. Okay. I want massage, like from the strand of my hair hmm, to my feet. In fact, to my to my toenails. Ah. All right, in that case, I think we should go inside while I give you a sore massage. Baby. Baby. <laughs> Stop getting ideas into your head. I said I wanted a massage, Happy not ending. massage. Happy ending. <laughs> <laughs> no happy ending. I'm tired. I know, I Please. know. I'm going to do my best oh. from here. My fear. Oh. Um, good morning. Good morning. Um, sorry. Um, I can see you're already on your way out to jog. Um, I was hoping I could maybe join you, since I don't know places around. Okay, sure. Let's go. Um, okay, fine. Um, please, can you wait for me for like some minutes? Let me go change something else. Oh, do I have that time? Uh, please. Please hurry up. All right. Thank you. Sorry, take it easy, okay? Easy, easy, easy. <coughs> Sorry. Sorry. Gentle, gentle. Good, good. Oh my God. What happened? She twisted her ankle. 
Oh, Alright, just hold on. Let me get water too. No, yeah. no, 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 don't worry. I, I can handle it. Let me help you stand up. Okay. Um. So let me know when you need anything. I'm inside. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Please, I need to get water. Oh, okay, I'm coming. Hold on. How is the leg? Getting worse. Oh, really? Yeah. I thought Kimmy said she could help. Yeah, she did. But the pain didn't reduce, so it got worse. I was hoping if you could help me check it out. Oh, sure, I am. set. Just um, give me a few minutes, let me go to the kitchen and get something. Okay. All right. All right. Oh. What are you doing here? I'm here to be sure everything is on point. For example, what are you what are you sitting on the couch for? Okay, go, 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 go. Like, oh, are you here on a meeting or something? Okay, fine. What is go. your problem? Shut up. Listen, this is your opportunity. This is my opportunity. You better don't ruin this for me. Okay, fine. Leave before he sees you. No, 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 no. Uh? Come sit here. Okay. Uh, uh, sit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You'll be fine, okay? okay thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> uh, uh. So, um, you have to endure because it's going to be a bit painful. All right? Okay. Um, be gentle. <laughs> I know you're a gentle man, right? And you should know how to handle a soft woman like me. I'm fragile. Where's the pain again? Uh, just somewhere around my ankle. All right. All right. Ah. Ah. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. You'll be fine, okay? Okay. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sit, 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 sit properly. Sit uh, properly. Okay, okay. go. What happened? Why Not out early. Uh, nothing happened. Listen, girl, that guy is a monk. I mean, <laughs> no man has ever acted this normal in my presence. Never. Hold on, let me understand you. So you mean you didn't seduce him? I seduced him. Of course I did. It is the man that refused to be seduced. Like you myself. I tried my best. Just stop playing. Maria, stop playing with me. I'm not playing Wait. either. I am not. This guy acted as if I am his fellow man. 
Don't you get it? <sighs> but not to worry. I think I have other plans. Mm -hmm. And this time around, it is going to work. Mm. I beg, food day for this house. At the edge. Go to the kitchen. Uh -huh. So you know if you go serve me. Mm. Oh, I'll too much. Dude, <laughs> you know I'm so happy for you. Yeah. That at the end of the day, you finally found what you're craving for. I'm well, so happy not, for you. Not, not yet. I'm still, I'm still watching her. Yes, I am, you know, but I mean, she's, um, she's becoming sweeter. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine. But listen, do you know that when you disappeared. Mm. She was literally crying up and down looking for you. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I, I had so. I you really? Had so. She's, she's coping up. Trust yeah. me, she's, she's for real. She's for real. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How's your leg? Feels better. I was tired of sitting in a spot, so I started to stretch it out a bit oh. yeah it helps it helps dude who who's that oh that's maria come on i'm not deaf i heard when you called her name i mean who is she She's Kimmy's friend, and um, she's going to be staying with us for a while. Okay. Did you see the beauty in that girl? Did you, did you see how hot that chick is? If I get this kind of girl, hey, okay, hire me. <laughs> Jeez. She just stepped outside. Maybe you can go on top with her. Nah, man. Not so fast. Moreover, I'm a gentleman. I'd rather see Kemi and speak to her about, you know, but, but her, then, <laughs> then I make my moves. <laughs> you know, I can't, I can't possibly strike to, you know, to fail. I just need to hit the right target, then I'm good. Now you savvy. <laughs> no go marry. You hear me? See who's talking. Don't even start with me. Because they don't manage put ring for that finger. You won't want it. Oh, guy, wait till you go chop. <laughs> Tell me. I don't see that food, you're hungry. Yeah, you know what I want to chop now. Can I help you? Um, yes, you can. I was thinking we could get to know each other, have a lick to gist. Just nothing to know about me. And I don't want to know anything about you either. Come on. Every man wants to know me. Except, of course, you're not a man. <laughs> Is someone challenging my manhood? Well, something like that. Since we're here together, don't you think that debate should be settled right away? <laughs> That's interesting. So how do you want it? Anyhow you want it. <laughs> Interesting. Mm -hmm. So, um... I don't have a condom here. You don't have any here? At all. Oh, okay. Um... What about we do it that way? I mean... It's actually tastier. Uh -huh. Interesting. Interesting. You know, I do not trust myself. And I don't trust you either. And um, I am not ready for any baby mama wahala. So please, Give me five minutes. 
I'll be right back. Five minutes. That's way too much. Oh, um, but I'm going to wait. Just wait. Yeah, sure. I'm here. I'm going to give you something no one has given to you before. I like the sound of that. Yeah. <laughs> you like it? Yeah, I'm sure going to like it. Five minutes. Two hours Nasa went out and he isn't back yet. from inside now. Eh? Um, this man locked me from inside though. Why? He said he wanted to go and get a condom. Why did you insist to go without? Refused. Mm. Anyways, maybe he locked inside because it is I don't know about the package now. You know what's gonna happen eh? Mm. Okay, that's true. That's true. Just stay put, eh? Make I go back to the palo. All right. Behave yourself. Okay? Play your card well. <sighs> Baby, I never see this guy, yo. Make you not be waiting at the thing, oh. <laughs> Wait. You think he locked me in here? <laughs> There's a possibility. No, now. Eh? You know they possible. How? <laughs> Mara, what if he does? Ha, huh? we'll go break the door. We'll break him. Who be this one? With the Chris? Break which door? You know they look around. I be eating say this one now, that kind look out the way you get for your house. Okay, now, you don't be like this now. What do you want me to do now? Because me, I'm not going to want me to come back and see me from inside here. Ha, huh? I go cast you. Mara, you wouldn't dare. I swear to God, you know fit. I have paid you your complete money, and the agreement is that whatever comes out of it, you do not mention my name. What if the wife can't kill me? You can't. People no fit. People no get that kind of liver. Oh, she can't fuck up this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they are back home. Hey, you back? Um, beam, beams. Kimmy, you, Kimmy, this is it, Kimmy. This... You are done for. This girl mentions my name. Ah, Mugbe, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to get in touch with it, you know. <laughs> What is what is going on here? Huh? Huh? I am I am truly sorry, Mr. Nusa. I am so sorry. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I don't understand. So this whole thing was planned? <laughs> it was planned. But one thing she didn't know is that I went ahead of her plan 
and completed it. <laughs> I was ahead of you, girl. I went 10 steps ahead. I played you in your own game. Girl, get used to it. <laughs> Listen, you didn't realize that Maria here happened to have worked with me three years ago in my office. Yes, she was a cleaner in my office. <laughs> ding dong, ding dong. I bet you didn't know that. Beans. Yeah. Why are you back early? Uh, everything is Where's okay. Nosa? He should be in your room. Oh, okay. Um, Beans. Sorry. Huh? I, I was hoping to talk to you about something. Um, I, I'll be right back. Let, um, let me finish. I, I'll come back. Okay. Oh, wait. Is that a woman you want me to sleep with her husband? Yes. So, so what's the plan? Kemi is paying me to seduce and sleep with your man. She needs videos and pictures of it as evidence. What for? I mean, why? What, what does she intend to gain from, from, from doing that? She, she told me two days ago, she asked me and I told her I am no longer interested. That my relationship is where I want it to be and I have no complaint whatsoever. And then she's going ahead behind my back to, to, to set you up with my fiance and, and, and get her proofs. Okay, so that what happens? I mean, why? I wh why is she doing this? I can get that answer for you as well. Why do you want to do this to her? Why? Because it is very obvious she's not even aware of what you want to do. Because I want to ruin her. Yes. You know, Bimbo has always been the fortunate one, right from secondary school down to our universe, up until now. She got all the favors while I struggled to get noticed. You know, when it was time for us to go for service, our golden girl was posted to Lagos. While I, Kemi, had to endure an entire year of misery in Kaduna. <laughs> so if that wasn't enough, she got a high paying job in Lagos in a very good company. She wasn't even out of service. And I had to juggle from one minute job to another just to make ends meet. So make it make sense to me. I've always wanted to be the first to get married. I've always wanted to marry early. But of course, as usual, our lucky princess had to take that away from me too. To think that I even saw Nosa first. Does that answer your question? <laughs> what did I ever do to you? What wrong have I ever done to you as a friend? I have always stood by you. Even in cases where it is obvious that you are fault, but I take the blame. As a friend, all I have done is to go ahead of you and take the bullets for your sake. Back then in secondary school, I remember you were always the troublesome one, the troublemaker. But I, I, I was always there to shield you. I don't even ask you questions. I fight for and then ask later. Do you remember our university days? I almost got myself expelled because I was trying to be a good friend. I was trying to defend you. And then you sit there to want to do this to me. I mean, why? Just why? How do you even do this? How? How do you how do you double as a friend, hater, enemy, all at the same time? Three roles wrapped in one. That must be really energy sapping and stressful. Babe, babe, well babe, done. Babe, I don't think there's need for those questions. There's no need. It's it's obvious. It's so obvious that she allowed herself to be engulfed with envy and jealousy. Shame on you. Look, listen, honey. 
you are going to go in there. Pick your piece and pieces together and get the hell out of my house and out of my life forever. Because I do not ever want to have anything to do with you. You're not worth it. Now get out. Please do better! Stop leaving! Evil friend! Friend Nemi! Um, Ma. What are you still doing here? It's time to leave. Okay, Ma. Leave. Sir. Get out, my friend. Who's this? I'm sorry. I was wrong. I had no business doing that. I'm sorry for putting you in this situation. I'm really sorry. You have to forgive me. And I, I, I promise I will never in my life put you in a situation like this ever again. I promise you. It's fine, you know. I'm a strong man. Thank you so much. Sorry. It's okay. Babe. Yes, darling. I have a confession to make. A confession. Yes. Babe, don't tell me you slept with that girl. God forbid. Ha. I've never cheated on you before. Okay, so what's the confession about? My... <clears throat> my full name is... Nosa Masio Idomodea. Okay, so? I am the only son of Idemodea, the Senate President of the Federation. You what? Yes. I'm sorry I, I kept it away from you. You know, I did because most of the ladies I dated in the past were all there because of my wealth. And I wanted someone who would love me for me. For me and not my father's wealth. Wait. If... If you're all this you say you are, why did you tolerate all my insults and disrespect? Because I love you. I love everything about you. Loving you has given me life. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the lies, please. No, 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 no. On, on the contrary, I should be the one saying sorry to you. I mean, I, I'm, I'm sorry for all that I did to you. I'm sorry. You, you know I did that not because I do not love you, but because I was insecure. It's okay. I'm sorry. Babe, it's okay. But how, how did you do this? How did you keep all of this away from me? Look, your apology is enough for me. You apologized even when you thought I had nothing. Okay, so it's fine. Goodness, I can't believe this. Oh, so, so, so this explains all of... Those figures you always talk about on phone, 17 million and all of those ridiculous numbers you always you always mention on phone. They're all mine. For real? Including the your friend, your old classmate you said gave you half a million and promised to give you a job. He's my manager. And the company you work for belongs to me. I am your CEO. Sorry. <laughs> How 
did you do this? Like, I work for you? Yes. Oh, my God. Your the last month's salary that was increased and you were so shocked. I approved it. Stop it! Babe! I'm sorry. Oh. oh, my goodness. This is unbelievable. I just wanted you to love me. No, no, listen, honey. Of course I love you. And you know, it's not about the money. It isn't. Because I loved you even before all of this. Okay? I just cannot stop apologizing for everything it's that okay. I've put you through. Okay. You know, I'm sorry. It's okay, babe. It's okay. I just hope that you do not use it against me in future. Babe, it's not possible. It's not possible. I swear to it. It won't happen, okay? Just let's just be happy together forever. Is it possible? This is like a dream. I love you.